In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to overlay your chat from Kick onto your monitor so that you can play games and also read your chat and you don't need a second monitor to look at your chat. So what we want to do is you want to go to this website here. It's a GitHub, so it's GitHub slash baffler slash transparent dash twitch dash chat dash overlay. You can type this into Google and it'll come up and there'll be a link down below. You want to go down here, go to GitHub here and download the latest release. And the latest release will be here. It says twitch chat overlay dash installer.exe. Now it doesn't it says Twitch but it works for um kick as well. So click that, install it, and then once you're installed it, you're gonna open it up and it's gonna look like this. Now what you want to do is you want to click this here, this little cog, go down to widgets, this is the important bit. So once we've got this open, we're gonna go back to kick and I'm just going to cancel that and we want to we want to go on to a website called botrix so botrix.live now this is a sort of widget software for streaming you want to sign in uh, first of all you sign in with discord and then you can link your kick so do that now you want to go to profiles and click on the settings on the kick one to make sure you're on the right uh, platform. Now go to widgets and here you can see there's one called chat. Now what you want to do, here you can customize how it looks. So this is what it looks like right now but you can customize it. Once you're happy you can go to widget URL and copy that. Now don't show people this because otherwise they can put your chat in weird places. Next we're going to press this cog up here, go to widgets and we're going to paste the widget in there. Now from here you don't want to close this, you want to minimize it. Um, if you if you close it then it's going to not work so you want to minimize it and on here you can remove the borders by pressing F9 um, this one here that will remove them, you press F9 again that's going to bring it back up see there we go so remove the borders on here like this and I'm just going to minimize this one here And now if you accidentally get rid of the borders and you can't get them back, you can go down to the bottom here, right click on it, and you can put toggle borders, which is going to turn them back on. So you can fiddle around with that. Now, if we hide that one, for example, we can hide this as well. Now if I type something into my chat, hello, you can see that it's popped up there, which is the thing we've just made. And then we can go back to here, toggle borders, and I can just like change where this is. I can turn this off like this and say hello everyone and boom that's just come up there. That's how you do it. If you enjoyed this video and found it useful please like subscribe and comment down below that it worked. Thanks for watching.